I was kind of thinking, would having been like with, with them for so long, 14, 15 years, yeah, yeah, yeah that you'd be used ago. to being part of a gang on the stage. You know the way a lot of people when they when they go out solo after a band, they really miss having the band there. I'm looking at you over there, and you're not really missing having the <laughs> no, other guys. Well, I'm not, you're not I'm missing the stools, are you? No, no, no. I'm, well, I'm, <laughs> I mean the stools that they used to get up off. <laughs> I'm, uh, no, I mean, I definitely, I love having plenty of people on stage to vibe off. You know, that's not yeah. changed for sure. Yeah, um, yeah definitely. No, I love those guys. There's a, yeah, there's a great, great energy. Off yeah, the, absolutely. The yeah, no, honestly, I love having them on the stage with me. They're great. And listen, so after, <clears throat> after 14 years or whatever, and then it just end, it ended, what, three years ago? Three years ago this summer, yeah. Was that weird for you then? Because I presume for 14 years, all your decisions are made, you, your life is kind of managed for you, you're, you know, all that, and then suddenly you walk out of Croke Park one night and suddenly out into the world, yeah? Yeah, um, I suppose it would be a lot weirder if it all just happened all of a sudden, like knee-jerk style. Um, but, you know, you have to remember we took a long time to make the decision. It was a very big decision to make to finish, you know, to, for Westlife to end up. And, um, like, personally, anyways, I can only speak personally. I was really ready for it to be over. And that, once again, none of this is ever negative towards Westlife. Of course. It was the most phenomenal years of my life or whatever, you know, over half my life. Um, but, you know, we made the decision for a reason. And um, so I think when you, when you make a decision and you know it's the right decision, then you're not scared, you know. You know it's the right thing to do. So there's something kind of... Yeah, it's, it's, you're not kind of really kind of worried about the future. You know it's the right thing to do. It's like whatever the future holds, I know that, you know, it's the right thing to sort of put an end, not an end to, but like to put a stop on this and to try something new and to just move okay. on.